righty, I have a quick Frontier Canada construction update for you guys. Um, and then shortly after this gets released, you're going to get an update on testing for Yukon Striker. Um, I have some really exciting news. Um, well, not news, I guess uh, some exciting updates to provide on the speed of Yukon Striker. Um, and I think you guys are going to be very pleased with what you see in that footage. But um, as you can see, the station is still looking the same. Um, it did start to slow down in terms of completion. Uh, you have that new building underneath um, the helix of Yukon Striker. It looks very church-like or house-like. I don't know what it's going to be. Um, it's in a weird location. It's like in the area of the queue line slash not in the area of the queue line. So I don't know what it's going to end up being. You have more digging taking place by the second Immelman on Yukon Striker. So we'll see what that turns into. The building over in... Um, Kingswood, almost forgot the name there for a second, is coming along nicely. It's got the same windows as the, the green building with the metal roof over in the uh, courtyard uh, in Medfair. So it's got the similar design to that. Um, and the pathway where Orbiter used to be is coming along nicely as well. In fact, it looks like they either poured cement um, because they were covering whatever they did on the pathway with tarps. Um, which I thought was really strange because Wonderland doesn't typically use cement or concrete um, when it comes to paths. So I thought it was weird that they're covering them. I've never seen them cover brickwork before with tarps. Um, I mean, it was supposed to rain today and it is raining. So maybe they were covering them for a specific reason to not like re remove the dirt or sand around that they put in between the cracks. It could be that. Um, but they were definitely spreading out tarps as uh, we were filming. So um, just thought I'd update you guys on that. Not sure if you're interested in the pathways. But again, we have some awesome footage of Yukon Striker testing coming up next. Um, so unfortunately, you won't get to see too much of that in this video. But I am really excited. Um, it's definitely looking good. And Frontier Canada um, on the daily keeps expanding. So... Um, I think we have two new buildings in total so far. I think a third one is starting. I can't confirm yet. I'm waiting till I see actual wood structure rise, but it looks like there is some sort of wood structure over by the second Immelman. I'm not too sure yet, but I'll wait and see. Um, and then I'm expecting something over down there by the second path. There's a little cutout in the dirt. Um, it's a very weird cutout too, the design of it. So I, I wouldn't be shocked to see that turn into some sort of building or maybe small restaurant, who knows. Um, but there is a restaurant right near it. So I can't see them putting a restaurant right next to a restaurant, but it is Wonderland and the food lines are crazy. Um, anyways, hope you enjoyed this really quick update on Frontier Canada. Um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like the video, and uh, stay tuned for that awesome video. Have a great weekend, guys. Bye.